Sanders O'Leary got the prettiest side for everyone to enjoy. Standing up close by the Christmas tree, glimmering light, I am right where I wanna be. I'll be home for a couple of days, wander around with you. You and me in the cold, thought it'd never be true. Wherever I go, I got you. Welcome back to my channel or if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is Sophie and today I'm bringing you a good old Christmas themed video aren't I so recently I've been popping into places like HomeSense, B&M, Home Bargains and even Primark Home and as I've been in there I've seen quite a lot of Christmas decor and quite a lot of like Christmas homeware pieces they've got some gorgeous bits and pieces in so I've got quite a bundle of different stuff so I thought I would show you it in this haul these aren't Christmas tree decorations I am going to save that for a separate haul because I've got quite a lot from home bargains so, so I might give you a home bargains Christmas tree decor video separately so yeah today I'm not going to ramble on too much more I hope you would like this video please give it a thumbs up if you do and let's get straight into it I'm actually going to start off with Primark Home and this little guy behind me how cute is he <laughs> he was one of my purchases from Primark I saw him and I was like oh my goodness he is too precious not to take home with me he was £3.50 look how lovely he is he's a really good size and I thought he would look so cute sat on my shelves so yeah I picked him up he's adorable I love his little jumper and his little scarf he's so sweet the next thing I picked up from Primark Home I did see this previously when I was in there but I saw it again when I was with my mum and I was like mum look at these and she was like you need them and I was like oh do I and she was like you need them and I was like they would look good because I have bought some of the cushions from home sets which I will obviously show you so these are beautiful I got two of them so they're a gorgeous forest emeraldy they are more forest green it looks more emerald blue on camera but they are more green in person that's really strange <laughs> but they've got gold Christmas trees on them and they're beautiful so they are a cushion cover obviously they're 43 centimeters by 43 centimeters I have actually got a couple of cushions already on my sofa in that size so I will just swap them over for Christmas and that's upside down so but yeah, how beautiful are they? So I've got two of them for the sofa. I'm going with my Christmas tree and Christmas decor in general, like the traditional like kind of reds, greens, and I'm introducing white in there as well. Um, so I feel like that will tie in really nicely in the living room. And these were £3.50 each. And the final thing that I picked up from Primark Home were just these little microfiber cloths. I love using microfiber cloths all the time I use them for a variation of different things cleaning even drying some of my pots I find that like works better um, these are themed for Christmas how pretty is that one it's got a little snowy house scene with little trees it's beautiful and we've got like the Rudolph I think we've got a plain white one plain red and plain green in there but I just thought they were really cute and they're always handy to have and they were £1.30 for a pack of five so I'll move on to home sense because I've already mentioned cushions we'll stick with the cushion theme so in home sense I actually showed these in my recent what's new in home sense November video so if you haven't seen that already I'll link that on screen for you because it literally shows you everything new that was in home sense in my local home sense anyway and they had so many beautiful pieces in so I got two of these and these are a beautiful red feathered cushion and yeah, I mean get two of them <laughs> um, they're defo karate chop cushions <laughs> if you know you know we love a good karate chop on the pillows um, just for for Christmas time I'm, I've got this vision so on my sofa at the moment I've got a large grey pink kind of like a cream cushion and then two little blue ones so I'll be covering the blue ones with the little green and gold Christmas tree cushion covers and then I'm going to be removing the pink ones from the sofa for this for the festive period and replacing them with the reds. I'll keep the greys and I'll probably keep the creams and then I'll introduce the other statement cushion which I'm going to show you in a second. But these were beautiful and I think these were £12.99 each so I'm just really happy with this. I just I can't wait to make my living room look super cosy and festive this year because the last 
how many years? This is our third year. Is this our third year? Yeah, this has been our third Christmas here. And I don't know why, but we have got a few festive bits and pieces, but I never went all out. I feel like I was always saving for other things and other things were priority. So we've just got like some basics, which is absolutely fine. But I just wanted to go all out this year. Like I said in my previous video, like I'm so excited for Christmas. Um, I know it's not really gonna be the same. Hopefully we can spend it with our families, but we'll see how that goes. But I just feel like the Christmas festive period Period is the only thing that's making me feel like happy at the moment so you know you got to do what makes you feel happy so going all out make it Christmassy and cozy yes. <laughs> so the statement cushion the final cushion that I've got for the sofa is this oh my goodness it's I just can't get over how gorgeous it is it's such a beautiful little snowy festive scene it reminds me of Kath Kidston a lot like it does remind me of that and I mean, I don't know if anyone's interested, but it does light up as well. <laughs> I won't, I don't think I'll be lighting it up, but we have the option there if we want to light the little windows and Christmas tree up. Although when I let go of it, it comes off, so I don't know if there's a way of keeping it on, but I'm not sure I'll be popping it on anyway, but it's just a beautiful long cushion and it's got red on the back. It's just absolutely stunning. And this was, we found a price for you. $14.99 and it's rather large it's just beautiful I'm so happy with it I can't wait I can't wait to decorate <laughs> okay so the next thing from home sense is this stunning Christmas tree ornament this is absolutely gorgeous it's white and it's got like the gold kind of edging and then I don't know if you can see it probably won't pick it up on camera actually but it's quite subtle it is a little bit sparkly but it's a very subtle sparkle like from a distance I can't really see it's not until you kind of like move the angles that it kind of just a subtle glimmer on the edges of the Christmas tree but it's absolutely beautiful they had a different variations of these I had more gold ones they had a few silver ones different kind of materials but they were all kind of on a shelf together and I did show that in my video I think I mentioned on that that I did pick up this little tree um I think it's such a good size and it what oh where's the price gone on it oh I think it was 12.99 or 9.99 price isn't on this um it was definitely 10 to 12 10 to 13 pounds around that area so yeah I'm sure it wasn't any more than 13 pound but it is beautiful I'm so happy with this I'm kind of envisioning it on my little side table that's next to my chair although I am wondering this year where the Christmas tree is going to go because last year and the year before we didn't have the chair and the little side table but it's fine we'll make it work even if it has to go in the window we'll do some shuffling because that's what that's what you all do at Christmas isn't it shuffle around your living room and try and get the Christmas tree in but yeah I'm really excited to style this I got really excited about these so I got two of them I can't get over how beautiful these little glasses are oh my goodness I mean to have wine or gin or cocktail or soft drink or mulled wine oh my goodness um they're just absolutely beautiful hand painted glasses and they've just got little Christmas trees on them, as you can see. <laughs> and I just love the little gold rim around the edging, um, the shape of them, the size of them. I just thought they were stunning. When I saw them on the shelf, I was like, oh, these are so precious. I love them so much. So these were 3 99 each. Got two, obviously, one for me and one for Ryan. But I thought these would look really pretty on our bar cart as well. So, oh, they're so cute. <laughs> just a sucker for Christmas-themed anything really and the final two things I got from home sense are actually candles and these smell incredible I've got this stuck <laughs> so they're two little ones and um, they're by DW home which is one of the oh, nicest like brands of candles that they do in home sense in my opinion they just always smell incredible on the tops they've got the little corks and the little hearts and they look like jammy dodger so I'm like oh great jammy dodger right now um I've got caramel apple and peppermint bark and they both smell incredible this one's obviously more minty fresh and this one's like gooey baking sweetness like a sweet sweet bakery you know oh <laughs> just it makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside and it says on them the North Pole Bakery I just think that is so cute but 
I mean, these look beautiful out. The red and white theme is what I'm going with this year, which is just an added bonus, really. I didn't really think about that. I just smelt them both, looked at the size, looked at the price. They are $2.99 each, and they smell incredible. I love Home Sense candles. I rave about them all the time. I'm sad that I'm putting away my pumpkin ones today, but I am excited because I am going to be replacing, not, not today, but I do a big kind of clean down and then next week i might start putting out the christmas decorations and bring out the candles although i might end up lighting one of these beforehand let's be honest <laughs> right we'll move on to home bargains there's only a couple of homeware pieces from there but like i said i've got a whole separate video coming of christmas tree decor for from home bargains because i got a lot and they really came through so affordable i just like rave about them so much because they were amazing i'm so chuffed with all that so stay tuned but did pick up oh, I love it I love it so much bamboo serving board in the shape of a Christmas tree this is going to be so perfect for a cheese board I'm just I just thought it was gorgeous I love doing little cheese board nights me and Ryan like doing all like little nibbly bits and pieces so I thought this would be really cute to just kind of serve it on a Christmas tree board and it has another price on it but I think it was like £3.99 I think it was £3.99 something like that so yeah, really good, and I thought it was so cute. And the final thing I got from Home Bargains was this gorgeous sweet jar. Um, when I walked in, I saw them. It's a really good sized jar, as you can see by the size next to my head. It's got a beautiful lid. It's got a little bow. It's the white and red themed again, which I was so excited about. And this was £1.49. And me and Ryan have agreed that we're going to fill it with lint chocolate balls because... That sounds incredible, doesn't it? And we're gonna pop it on the kitchen side and it's just gonna be full of chocolate. I'm really excited about it. <laughs> right, we'll move on to the final shop, guys. We're nearly there. B&M. B&M are great for Christmas decorations, Christmas gifts, Christmas homeware, and um, I had to pick up a couple of bits and pieces. So, I got these beautiful snowy trees. I have to be careful because if I keep picking at them and that the little snow can drop them off so i'm having to be really careful with these but they are gorgeous and i thought these would look beautiful on my shelves or even in the window actually the frosted trees were eight pound and they are just stunning i'm really happy with these i love the log at the bottom it's covered in little fake snow it's just Oh, I just love it so much. They just scream traditional Christmas to me. I love them so much. I'm pleased I got them actually because I was in an R and I was like, do I need them? And I was like, of course I don't need them, but like, they are beautiful. And also to dress up like my shelves in that, I mean, the kitchen, I was gonna say the kitchen, it is kitchen, living room, it's like open planned. Um, I got this Merry Christmas sign. This is just a big wooden sign and it's got like gold around the edges. I just thought this was beautiful. It would look so perfect on the top shelf. I'm really, really happy with this. And I think this was five, yeah, this is five pound. Um, this little tag is beautiful, a little gold foil on it. It says Christmas Cottage, Wooden Merry Christmas. How pretty. Anyway, I digress. This is beautiful. I just thought it'd look really nice just to dress up the shelves. It's nothing like too in your face Christmas. It's nice and subtle, but just thought it was a really beautiful decoration. Right, the final two things aren't really Christmassy. They are wintry and <laughs> same thing, yeah. <laughs> so, I needed some new bedding. I didn't actually, we didn't need new bedding. We wanted some winter bedding and they had the most beautiful white Arctic faux fur duvet set. This is stunning. When I first saw it, I saw it ages ago and I didn't remember it being kind of like ribbed and I got my mum and dad to like kind of have a look when they were in there and they FaceTimed me and I was like, I don't remember it being like that but I needed to see it again in person, you know when you just need to see it for yourself so I was like, whenever I'm next in, I'll have a look and yeah, I am really, really happy with it actually, like when I'm looking at it. The best thing about this is it's in its own little bag so when it's been on the shelf, if people have been touching and stroking it, as they do, um, it's they're stroking the bag and the actual duvet is inside which is which is great i know from the get-go it's not been touched too much um it's gonna go in the wash first anyway but yeah i just thought it was quite nice that it's come in the bag it's from the copper and rose rose range and it's 25 pound i just thought it's going to be super snuggly and i think it's going to be more timeless because if i get like a proper christmasy bed in obviously as soon as christmas is over i kind of can stop i have to stop using it well i don't have to stop using it but you know what i mean like you think oh we can change it up now um but because it's kind of wintry and timeless it's white i thought this will last through all the winter months which 
ends up like being February, March time, doesn't it? It's always cold in the UK. But yeah, I'm really, really happy with this. I'm so excited to get it on our bed. I can't wait. And then to go at the end of the bed with that is this absolutely stunning fro. It is the Oakwood Faux Fur Fro, and it's from it's from the range Heritage Collection, and it was £20, and it's the most beautiful, stunning colours, and it's just going to look absolutely incredible laid at the end of the bed on top of the cream faux fur duvet set. I am so excited about this. I'm so excited to get it, like, all washed and on the bed and ready to get cosy. I cannot wait. Um, so, yeah. It says on here, extra cosy, thermal lining. I'm all about the coziness, guys. I love it. Um, obviously, at night, if it gets too hot, I'll probably take this off, but it's going to look beautiful just, just on the bedspread. So, really happy about that. So, that is everything that I've picked up recently. There's quite a lot of different bits and pieces there. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Have you been picking up any Christmas pieces yet, or is it too early for you? I don't know. Like, I know it's too early, but I keep thinking in my head while I see it, might as well get it because I'll end up waiting, and then all the stuff that I want will end up disappearing. So, I'll be like pretty good about that. So, I just thought, we'll get it now. Out, then I've got it. Um, I'm really happy with everything I picked up. I really hope you enjoyed it anyway. I know it's quite early but who doesn't love a bit of Christmas content? I hope you all take care of yourselves and subscribe if you want to see some more Christmas content from me guys. I'll see you next time. Bye!